Hello, good morning to everybody. How are you? How are you all today? Well, today is an amazing day here in Valencia, sunny, and well, what a day. Well, I'm preparing a few cases for my next lecture, and I want to show something with you uh, a case solved uh, using uh, aligners. I'm uh, I'm totally in love with the with these techniques and uh, now as you know I'm working more with spark aligners that are uh, for me like the top level of aligners this one this case that I'm going to show you um, is solved with my my philosophy using uh, um, uh, invisible aligners okay so the idea of this case is I use infraziomatic screws Okay, to solve a severe problem of deep bite and class 2 because the idea in this case was, as you can see here in the pictures look at the narrow smile that this woman presented and the idea here was to improve and to give her a wider arch also modify the torque of the bite to give her a full mouth smile and uh, intrude the frontal teeth a little bit, give her more top from canines to the back in order to do this disposition. Uh, as you can see, because she presented a narrow upper arch, the teeth in the frontal protruded, and uh, the idea of this case is going to be to solve this severe class 2, as you can see here, where also the can the occlusal plane is canted, okay? Uh, the bilateral class 2, the deep bite, Okay, and analyzing the arches, you can see we have a really upper narrow arch and also uh, because we have a collapsed upper arch where the molars are rotated, where the second molars are expanded. I'm going to take advantage of the expansion of the second molar to compress them and it will help me to develop the arch. Okay, and this is the problem that we have a class 2 malocclusion with the retrocyte polyphy and where upper and lower incisors are, uh, are, uh, are retroclined some of them and uh, the, the, the lower one and the upper are protruded. The lower speed curve is so increased, okay? Once again, we can see that the problem is the protruded maxillary that is increasing the gummy smile and the retrusive mandible, okay? So the case that I'm going to do, as you can see here, I'm going to do the upper molar sterilization protocol but I am going to do a modification, look at here. I'm moving also the molar to distal, okay? I develop the rest of the arc, and in this situation is when I'm going to retrieve from five to five, okay? So I'm not doing the pure distal protocol, I'm going to do it uh, because I'm going to use mini screws. It's first I distalize second and first molar to class one, and then from five to five, doing intrusion, retrusion, and limoritol, eliminating the, the the palatal attachments, okay? As you can see here in RN21, it's when I'm going to put the mini screws for anchorage when second and first molar are in class one, okay? The attachments, you can see the attachments, passive attachments in the teeth where I'm going to do the class two elastics. Also, we have some anchorage attachments in the back, passive attachment to help me to do the reducement uh, of the lower speed curve, what I'm going to do is to procline into in literability, giving back al root, sorry, lingual root torque, then I will do the IPR and then more intrusion, retrusion and lingual root torque. Okay, it's biomechanics, pure biomechanics, okay? I will do symmetric IPR from missile 3 to missile 3, okay, 5 fire aligners, and you can see here how, look at the beautiful, okay, here it's still on treatment, but look at the beautiful engagement in class 1, where the midline are centered, where I solve the deep bite. Look at the beautiful engagement, the final arc shape that is beautiful. or oh, it's nice, okay, I work a lot. And this is the final, look at the perfect engagement in, in class one in both sides, where I center the midline, I solve all the problems. Okay, the final arc shape of the upper arts, okay. You can see here the way I plan it, okay, what I did is Compression of the seven, back al root torque, and expand onto the six. So I'm going to take advantage to compress the seven, to expand the six, to align the teeth in the front. Okay, look at the video, look at the morphing, how it's going to work. Here you can see how we start. 
with the bilateral class 2, the bite, the blue serpent was canted in the middle of the trimming with the screws, and then at the end of the trimming with everything clean and with the final occlusion in class 1. And the change in the aesthetic of the image, you can. So, working with this philosophy of trimming, I can hear a wider arch, full mouth smile. I will do intrusion, retrusion, and limbo reduction, so I will reduce the gummy smile in the front, better balance with the lips. And as you can see here, the evolution that is uh, amazing. Okay, so one more case that shows that the team aligners and screws work really well with my protocols, with Diego Pedro protocols. And if you want to know more about these protocols, three options. You can come to do an in-office course, send me a message, write to an email to Diego Pedro Academy, Diego Pedro with Y, Diego Pedro Academy with Y at gmail.com. Also, you can uh, download the Inbi Ortho Pro app in the app store all the protocols are there you can download one payment and you can have unlimited access forever and also you have master coin three days that can change your life master coin www.mastercoin.com so well keep in touch i will i will continue posting cases enjoying the life because for me that's amazing i love it Okay, so thank you very much. Have a good day.